Okay, so this is a little tutorial on how to do accents on Mac. So if you watch this keyboard right here, you'll see exactly what I press. For example, this is space and delete. And if you look over here, you'll see what happens when I press these wonderful keys. So let's say I want to write que pasa. Well, first I need that upside down question mark, right? So press R, Alt, Shift, and question mark. So notice how I press Alt, Shift, and then this backslash sign. So Alt, Shift, question mark. And then our regular K Q, U, and then to the accent on E, you do Alt, E, release, and press E again. Okay, and all of those lovely accented uh, letters follow that. So if you want to do an accented I, it's Alt, E, release, press I. Alt, E, release, O. Alt, E, release, U. Alt, E, release, A. To do the same with capital letters, same pattern, Alt, E, release, Shift, A. Alt, E, release, Shift E, and so forth. So not bad at all. Then we just have to remember a few of the weird things, like umlauts. So if I want to do the write the word linguistica, ling, okay, now I need the umlaut. So Alt U gives me an umlaut. Release, press U. And then again, Alt E, press the I, linguistica. Okay, so remember, Alt U gives us umlauts. And then we can do tildes using Alt N. So see how my pre I'm holding down Alt and it shows me right where that tilde is. So Alt N and then N again. Give me tilde. So B A Alt N release N Anya. And last but not least, if I want to say, if I want an exclamation mark, do Alt. One. So note how that one changes when I press down Alt. So the gray buttons are what I'm pressing. And then see that one becomes an upside down one. So let's do Dame Lo. Thank you, Juanes. And then our regular exclamation point. So hopefully this will be a little useful. And hopefully you've learned something all while the wonderful Murray Hammond of the old 97s watched us. I hope this works.